What is up guys? Beast Mode here and we're gonna do something a little bit different today. Um, I've done a few few videos and I get a lot of questions now about how his priest is set up and I finally got him to five star silver during the last tee up and I've been wanting to make this video for about a week now. But I don't want to just do the same thing like over and over again and he's definitely stronger now but I'm gonna do like a little heads up with him uh, with another amazing tech. I'm gonna do Dawkins. I would have done Hogan because or all three of them in this video but I didn't get Hogan and I think he's gonna be the best of all of them but Priest and Dawkins are like heads up really close. I, I definitely give the edge to Priest. Others see it differently. That's all good. Either way, you're getting everything done turn one in a feud, usually, <laughs> or turn two maybe. Against Titans, same thing, turn three at worst. Um, but we get a lot of bleed uh, lane bonuses, so I, I gotta give the edge to Priest in that situation. Like this feud coming up, he's got, uh, uh, let's go look at it, and then we'll go through the numbers. Let me show you, um, feud. I think it's like 100% to his finisher, and then he's also getting 200 to the bleed, and then he's getting another 100 from a perk. Yeah, you get 200 bleed, 100 finisher there, and then the perk. So I'm going to go through the numbers and show you, but uh, where the heck is it? I haven't even bought it yet. Um, let's go to replace just started working on them. I like that they put the pyros and the uh, snowfalls in there finally. That's legit. And then they got uh, the sub. Like, there's a lot of really dope perks this month. What am I doing here? Um, I feel like I'm missing one. Which one had the bleed? Is it this one? Oh, all right, all right, all right. There it is. All right, so you get 100 here. 200. Uh, I'm also going to do a um, boogeyman video this weekend because I've been waiting on this uh, this lane bonus for him. So look out for that. So we're going to do heads up. We're going to go Priest. We'll do like five matches. We'll do Dawkins. We'll do five matches. I got them both five star silver. They're both hooked up. Got nice plates on or um, straps, excuse me. Decent metals. And, you know, you'll get, get a good look at them. Now, the, the one thing with Priest that's a little bit of a drawback is you kind of need a uh, tech Triple H or uh, Hollywood Hogan. You can get around it another way if you do a five and a three match, but it's a lot safer with uh, with one of those two guys. So real quick, I'm just going to take you through him, and then we'll do some matches, take you through Dawkins, do some matches, and we'll get a really good look at him. So we got the seven charge, the blue. Um, you guys can see the screen. Uh, four, it makes You get to choose four. We're going to have Razar on. He's going to get another couple for you, plus the blue MP, which is going to get him turn one. We're going to use the green that reloads. And then I'm also going to show you his other green move because it's pretty wicked good too. And then that finisher is what's like legit as hell. So it's 167K, and then you get 169K bleed. But you're going to get 300% to the bleed and 100% to that finisher. It's going to be about 4 mil turn one this feud. Like crazy 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 damage if it was against a titan you might turn one the titan i mean that's how crazy this uh, lane bonus is going to be entourage we got to roll with lawler and razar like i said our truth you could use gooker you could put uh um uso in there, in there like whoever gives you a boost to the green you could also do the bleed like carry but i like to get a bigger the biggest pin i can so they can't get up you know, if it's a smaller pin, even though the bleed's clicking, they have an, a better opportunity to get up. So I, I don't like to use carry, but you can if you want. All right, let's get out there. You know who we're going against? This is pretty much one of the strongest guys I could find to fight that everybody can fight. So it stays like, you know, on a level playing field, so to speak. So right off the bat, we know we're looking for two, three matches. or uh, Yeah, two, three matches. And then we're just going to go to town. So we're going to do, he's got 1.7 mil. We're probably going to do about 1.5 or so on turn one. So just pick some spots you don't think you're going to cascade. It, it's very rare that you catch a cascade to pin because even one match you're still good. 
and then hit the green. The green is now up to 513k. That's damn strong. And that refills the blue. So even if they get up, you're ready to go again on two, three matches. And look at this. 560k plus a 400k bleed. Watch his health. Boom. And here comes the bleed. Look at that. Just, just gross. Just super, super gross. He's good. Um, and this is why I like him more than Dawkins. Dawkins, I have an extra turn belt on him, so I could always take a swipe and hope that that works. But he does 1.2 mil with his two moves. I'm going to show you in a minute. But when you use the third move, like 60, 70% of the time, it'll pin. And I don't really like that. I threw a uh, DX plate on him, and I tried to run him with Fury to try to boost up that pin a little bit and hope that would be enough damage, but it's, it's kind of not. Um, if you could do the 1.2 mil and then, I don't know. If you're going against a striker, like they're dead anyway because they have less HP, but we'll, we'll go through him next. Let's do a couple. I'll do two this way for Priest, and then I'm going to show you his other move. So when people are going to have like anti-bleeds, he's still freaking amazing. He's really good. So, and I've been getting a lot of questions lately about how he's set up. And I've made like, you know, quite a few videos with him in it, but only one that like really showed like how he was set up and how he's ran. So that's why I wanted to do this one. And I just didn't want to do it the same way. I want to like, I'm going to start making some videos of like guys head up. Like if you're trying to pick Hall of Fame, I'll do like two Hall of Fames or three Hall of Fames that are really good. And we got five star gold coming out probably next month. So, man, I hope you guys are hoarding up them resources. <laughs> I know I am. I have been for a hot minute. I mean, look how good he is though. He's just so fast, so easy. Look at that, is he gonna get up? Nice little cascade. All right, so you saw that little cascade. I'm gonna show you another way to run him. And you could actually get this move off twice in the same turn, but it's so hard. You need DX, Triple H, you need Hollywood Hogan, and then you got to set up two five matches and not cascade either of them. But you can get the you can get it done twice. But I'm not gonna do all that. Um, but let me show you the move though. It's pretty dope. It's pretty dope. It's not maxed yet. I haven't even really leveled it up yet. So um, it does far less damage though. Look, you're at 66K, but it reduces their kick out twice. So their first two kick outs are only gonna be half the damage, which is really good. Plus the bleed's going off at the same time, but you don't refill. This is like a one hit wonder. You cannot, you're gonna die if this doesn't work. You're going to be stuck in like no man's land. So you're going to do the same thing. You're going to do the two, three breaks. Um, this one's pretty dope. And this one's pretty dope. And then this is going to reduce it to 50%, but look how much less damage. We were at 513K. Now we're down to 220K. I mean, that's a lot. And the more HP you don't take off, like the finisher is 556 with 170k bleed. Nice. Take that. But if they get up out of this, you're in big, big trouble. And he's got some blues and look, he's got a five match that's going to catch those reds, but it's going to be a... Yeah, he's going to take it too. That was only 50%. Look, he's still at 400k. That's 50%. He would have been up by now. Look at that. So that move is pretty legit. It really is. I really like that move. I just like taking more HP away, so I use the other one. Plus I feel like it's like a safety net because you're reloaded for turn two. You know what I mean? So even if they had some like crazy two mil health and they got out of the pin somehow and the bleed didn't go down enough, you're gonna do it again. And now it, you do 1.5 mil turn one, um, but you're gonna do three mil on the second go around. So they're gonna be dead if they caught, if they got up. All right, let me show you now my other home skillet. I still love this guy, like don't get me wrong. He's, he's fucking good. 
Um, let me make sure I got the right moves on. Because I had a... I was playing blue, 13 greens, and purple. That's right, yeah? Okay. Um, Entourage for him, Lawler. Uh, hopefully you have an affiliation if you're using both of them. And then he gets actually a little bit better of a boost to his moves because you don't need the uh, Rizar for the... Like, like Priest basically has two MP trainers. That's why Rizar's in there, so he stays turn one in a few. Uh, you don't need that with Dawkins, but you do have to be wary of um the cesar or yeah cesaro he has minus three green so if you were going to use steel and try to have those greens loaded turn one you got to look out for that oh yeah no, no i'm so happy i talked my way through that i can't use lawler what an ass hat <laughs> that's my bad all right all right yeah so you gotta you gotta look out for um for cesaro yeah we gotta use steel goofball That was funny. Yeah, because uh, if you start with the blue, you're just going to make a bunch of gems and pin them, dummy. All right. Then we're going to go our truth or, or uh, yeah, we're just going to switch our truth over from Dawkins. Where is he at? Where is he at? Where is he at? There he is. So you get to stack more move damage on Dawkins than Priest, but you don't get the bleed. Um, plus, Dawkins, you're going to see pins a lot more often. And then we have to move over our five, uh, our tier five metal. What happened? Oh, and use. Now, I kind of want to take the uh, DX plate off because I was playing around with another move set because of Cesaro, but I don't like super love it. All right. I got all flustered when I messed up the MP trainers for a second. Now I'm trying to like scramble and get back on track here. Oh, and also make sure you look out for stuff like this. This metal is 7% green move damage. This one, 8% green move damage. This one, 4% green move damage. So you want to like use those sub substats in your advantage. So look out for stuff like that. Um, now, so Dawkins, okay. The goal with him is to not pin with the blue move. So you could finish somebody off. You could do like 2.4 mil turn one, but it does pin quite often. And it, now with the DX plate, I don't know if I should have done that, to be honest with you. But I was trying some other move sets out. So right here, you're going to go 568. So you're going to do what? Like, uh, what, 1.1 mil? A little bit more than that. And now here's the, here's the thing. You don't want this to pin. Now I have a um, extra turn strap. So if there if I was in a feud and there was a green match right here, I would swipe it and take my chances and hope that it procked. But I don't, so I got to take this. And the problem is he makes so many damn gems. A lot of the times it'll pin. See, even if I didn't hit hit that X break, that was gonna be a pin. And that's the problem. See, we did less damage. Remember with Priest, we were down to, what, 150k health left? Right now, he's at 400k. But what's great is now I get to do it all over again. I didn't even have to hit that move, actually. I could have just hit the other one and ended it. But let's pretend we were on turn one and there's that green match. This is what I, this is what I would have done. I would have just taken a swipe and hoped that my... Wow, okay. And then hope the... Uh, the thing went off, the uh, extra turn uh, plate, belt, <laughs> that thing. <laughs> so we're going to do a couple of matches and, you know, you'll get a good look at it. They're both pretty stacked. I got them built up both really well. So I, I'm really not loving the X break plate on them, though. But in a Titan feud, oh, man, this guy's money because his pins are so small, they're going to kick out. So usually it takes you like three turns to beat a Titan. And like you could be you could do that in like a minute, minute and a half. Like he's so fast. You could beat a Titan in like three to four minutes max. Like that's overboard. The reason I had to use him on the last Titan feud is because my priest was five star bronze. And I couldn't blow my talent up. So I had to just leave him there. And if Balor did one bleed that procced on me, it would kill me. So I couldn't use Priest. I would have loved to have used Priest. He does way more damage. 
All right, let's see. Let's get back on track here. No green matches. There's actually not that many green gems on the board. This might not even pin him. This, this might be one of those times where you get to do it again. And that's when he's better. Nah, see, it's still pinned. And there was like no greens. I didn't have the X thing go off. Yeah, see, this is why I like Priest more. He's just a guaranteed turn one killer, man. Priest is a little bit of a gamble. Or uh, Dawkins is, excuse me. But they both do like six, sick amount of damage. I think, oh, why'd I hit that? He's already in danger, you weenie. I think that Priest is like 1.5 mil with like, forget the like bleed bonuses and feuds, this and that. Priest is like 1.5 mil turn one, fully recycled. And Dawkins is 1.2 mil turn one, up to 2.4 mil turn one. That's like the like breaking point. Dawkins, if he doesn't pin on that one move, can just do his moves over again. Let's, let's do a couple matches and see how many it takes us to get there. And I might actually take off this X plate. I was waiting for the month to reset. But now that it has, like, I, I kind of want to do that. I was looking for another way to run him. And I was trying to use, like, a there was, like, a purple move. And it still did. I think I even made a video on it. I just never posted it. I think it still did, like, 1.2, 1.3 mil. But it was, like, a pain in the ass to get to work. <laughs> it just wasn't loving it. I guess if you did a bigger pin, ran with Furies in a cheap shot play, that might be kind of cool. Then a like 300k pin might be enough, because his pins are so small. It's like one of his biggest uh, drawbacks is his small pins. Alright, let's see if we don't cause any ruckus this time. It's their third time through and it hasn't happened yet. Yeah, see? Again. Like, even without that X break on that one, like, that was a pin. That's our third time through. This is, like, the biggest tilting point for me with when I go heads up and, like, decide who I'm going to use for something is what's going on right now. He's just pins very, very often. I wish he had a friggin' choose move. How cool would that be? That would be, like, insane. But he does sick damage, right? Like, 600k per move? Like, what? Let me get that. <laughs> Let me get that. Alright, cool. Alright, let's do it one more and then we'll switch back. I think this is the third time we've pinned early each time. And like I said to you earlier, it's, it's probably like a 70% chance of pin. So, you count on that 1.2 mil, but when it doesn't pin and you get to hit that 2.4 mil, like, that's perfect. It's just random. And when you're making 13 random gems on a board, like your chances are very slim that you're not going to pin. Right? Like that's a, that's a lot. <laughs> I wish it was like a, a minus. I guess in Feud 2, it's pretty cool because if the people are running like the minus 3, so you're only making 10, like that's perfect. That's the best. That's actually really cool. Because you only need to connect to 1. Because you you got your 1 MP from your turn. You got your three plus two on a match is five. So that gets you back to six, so you get to go again. All right, let's see. This is your last chance. Come on, Dawkins. Come on, Dawkins. So here you go, 1.1 mil right there. And then this one's only 50K and then 13 randoms. There's a lot of greens on the board though. Perfect. Ah, oh, haterade. I didn't get, I don't have the plus one from my uh, trainer or coach. Uh, it is what it is, right? Let's see if the extra turn bell goes off. Nope. <laughs> that sucked. Usually that works. I guess the three doesn't work because I was just saying that. Three plus the two, but we had already used it that turn, so it didn't work. Maybe I run them with, uh, I'd have to run them with Hollywood. Or DX uh, Triple H, just like I do for what's his name? What's his face? Uh, Priest. All right, so you just got a really good look at him, though, right? So you, you guys can like judge for yourselves. I'm not here to tell you how to play. I'm <laughs> just trying to help you out. Let's try. Uh, we'll go back and do one more. 
and then you know what I might even I might even do a, a my VS I'll just do this like a tech heads up thing I'm not using Sako because I freaking hate Sako when everybody started throwing them up on showdown defense I mean I haven't touched that card in six months I hate Sako and he's really good I mean don't get me wrong he's awesome I just I just hate him he's like one of those cards I just wish I didn't even have um let's see let's do let's let's, let's mess around with old chiefy chief let's go to rail let's go to class who else can we throw in this heads up competition? Chief. Um, yeah. Everybody else is a little bit underbuilt still. I thought Drew was going to be a little stronger than he turned out to be. Um, Roman. Oh, man. That dude can hit you hard. Like, he just hits you, like, a bunch of times. Like, on the same turn. Just keeps going. Again, going, going, going. He'd be fun against the Titan. I actually might make him my next. Now, I took up Chief because one of my faction mates didn't have, like, one of these really top tech guys. So, he was asking about him. And I took him up. He's dope. He's really good. I might have to switch some uh, stuff around. So, just bear with me for a second. We're going to need green. <sighs> yep, 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 yep. And then I'm going to have to move that metal again. It's my only 200% green. As a matter of fact, I only have two. Of the 200% ones, I have green and black. So I just have to keep moving them all the time. Um, what did I do here? I think that he was move damage. Yeah. He, oh, wrong one. Now, when the when the 150% green move finisher comes out, he's going to be a lot better. That's 35%. Where's the... Where you at, homie? There you are, KO. Um... Yeah, he's going to add another like 100, 100 and something K to his finisher. And this feud is going to be wicked cool. I'm very excited about this coming up feud. Um, who's green? There you go. And let's do 10 more percent with Ivar. Switch the metal and then I'll show you how this guy looks. Where you at, Ivar? I'm actually using Ivar this feud. I was kind of excited to see him um, up there. I don't like his uh, tag partner very much. The striker. That was his name. Oh, man. He's just got no medals on. Oh, that was pretty sad to see, huh? Look at all these freaking parts I'm wasting. <laughs> that's not that smart. All right. That's Tate. That's that. Uh, let's put... Uh, Let's just throw any takedown on and grab that 15%. Just because, oh, that's Fury. Now I have to waste another 10K. What an ass hat. <laughs> what was I doing? There we go. <laughs> you idiot. Whoopsie. All right, let's throw on a takedown and get the heck back out there. I think this is takedown, isn't it? Yeah. Oops. Uh, you know what? I'd rather have something with percent, though. Is this one max? Yeah, let's just throw this one in there. All right. All right. All right. All right. Let's get out there. So with this dude, you're going to run him with these two, two charge moves that feed each other. You got to catch one purple match and then the hit with the hardest finisher you can get. He's actually... Fantastic. I think he averages about 1.3 mil turn one. As long as you catch a match. That's like, if it was a choose, man, he'd be like so much better. But it's a random. So, what you know, you got to take what you can get. <laughs> so right off the bat, he got to kind of keep uh, running total with this guy. So you're going to fill the finisher. I think you end up like one short. Let's see. In a feud, I think you end up one short. Right now, we're not. And then you hit him right here for 200K. So we're at like 250K. Catch one. Perfect. Then you fill it again. And now you have a choice. Do you want to do it again or just go for the pin? Um, there's not a lot of purple. 
So, but this is not, yeah, let's do it one more, one more time. 253, four, so now we're at 500K. Or you can switch the order in which you do them. All right, perfect. So 500K and now boom. This is now one mil plus the gem damage. And you're looking to make a cascade if possible. Like if we lay these here, we're gonna get those greens on the bottom. Uh, but there's two reds on the left and the right. There's one here, yeah. Uh, I'm going for it. I'm going for it. Yes, perfect. 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 That's what's up. Nice little cascade. So there you go. 600K there. He's down to 500K. And the match is over. So he's awesome too. And he's only five star bronze. The other two guys are five star silver. So he's got a lot of room for improvement. You saw how lame his uh strap is i think if you do i don't think he really needs like a, a special plate to get the mp going because it's just two charges but we used the purple first now let's do it again we'll use the green first kind of kind of bounce around a little bit and this will probably be like the last one i might do one more priest just to show you his freaking awesomeness i love him He's going to hit for about 4 mil turn 1 this coming up feud. That's just gross. Maybe it's 3 mil. I'll do the math. Let me see. So he's going to do 200k bleed. This 400k for the first bleed. And then you get 300% here. Let's, I want to make sure I'm doing this too. So you could go green first. And then... Oh, that's so unfortunate. Yeah, he's the one. Oh, okay, that's perfect. All right, green first. See, we didn't catch a cascade. So you use the purple, which is going to fill both the greens. And now you go again with the green. So now we're, we already did 500K. We even get to the pin yet. The problem is there's more purples. Now you can cascade. See? <laughs> that's super risky. And then you could... I, I didn't even need to use the purple. What a goofball. Because if he gets up, I just screwed myself. And then we're not going to throw more purples out now because it's going to pin. So we'll hit the finisher. And let's catch this. That's going to make a row break on the bottom of purples. Beautiful. Nice, nice. Take it. Take it. So same amount of damage. Uh, what was that? 1.2 mil turn one. Looks like you might get out of this one. Nope. So there you go, three absolutely amazing techs. I don't have um, Drew belt, uh, built. Uh, Merrick's just dropped a video, so check that out. Um, he's got him, I think, five-star bronze, and it's pretty good. And then uh, Roman, I, I don't have Roman built either, but like level 80, he still does like crazy amounts of damage. So those are, those are another two really, really good techs. And if you're like one of the rare guys that have Hogan, um, I don't want to hear about it. <laughs> uh, it's a little salty about that uh, bonus on the portal still. Let's do one last one just to show you who, who the fucking real man is. <laughs> Where are they? Uh, hello? There you go. Yeah, I can't wait this feud. All right, so while I'm doing the match, I'm going to go through the numbers so I can tell you what his finisher is going to be. Let's put the other move back in. I think our um, entourage is good except for one guy. Yep, our truth back in. Our truth, our truth, our truth. Yes, sir. I wish I had Gooker. Gooker would be beautiful because then you could do... Uh, well, I guess he still needs DX, so... Yeah, I guess it wouldn't matter. And then we'll throw back in our Vitality Tier 5. And I am done wasting metals for the day. Metal parts, that is. Alright. So his finisher is... Uh, oh, I didn't get a look at it. His finisher's... 167 so the bonus you get on those lane bonuses it's not of like oh my i got up to 500k and i got a 100 percent bonus you know you don't get another 500k it's to the 170k so he's gonna get an extra so he's gonna do 340 
on the finisher. It, well, and I, let's look at the finisher, and then it's plus another 170k. So he's gonna be at so five fifty five sixty um, six sixty. So what's that? Seven hundred twenty k. Then he's gonna get the bleed at four hundred k four times. He's getting a two hundred percent from the lane, a hundred from the perk, plus his. So it's gonna be four 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 and four. And then this move is five hundred, and then another hundred from the other move in gems. All right, well, I'll do this while the gems are smashing. I'll add up these numbers. It's it's stupid. You know what? That might cause a cascade, but I don't really care. I'm counting right now. 7, 4, 8, 12, 16. Yeah, he's going to do... It's a little over... Um, Three mil. I was looking at the wall doing my math. Did I did I screw something up on that, or did I cascade because I was like not paying attention? I'm gonna have to watch and see. I was I was doing the math on the wall. I'm writing on a wall of the shower I'm building, <laughs> and I looked up and it was it was my turn again. <laughs> yeah, it's two point nine two mil turn one. That's just stupid. <laughs> That's just stupid. But there you have it. Like. You got a good look at uh, Dawkins, got a really good look at Priest, and you got uh, Chief Mayavia, man. He's he's pretty legit as well. Like, uh, if you had all any of those guys uh, built up, you're you're doing real well for yourself. And yeah, Sako too, I guess. But man, I just can't stand that card. I just can't stand it. No more Sakos, please. So happy they're starting to phase him out in the showdown defense. <laughs> I'm so happy about that. Oh. One more thing. Um, I've been doing a lot of like hanging out in the streams lately. Um, I always check out, uh, I try to check out Merrick's, but he's on the weekends usually, and that's like kind of my busy or, or like family time. Um, DJ is awesome. Gerson's is awesome. And Goldie, that girl Goldie, she just started streaming. So um, I don't know if she has a set schedule, but if you go on. I think it's Twitter, and look for that girl, Goldie. She's just start getting started, so definitely give her, like, some some love. Maybe check out a stream, see if you guys like her. She's super entertaining, and she's a really, really good player. So I just wanted to throw that out there for you guys. And uh, this will be the final match, because I got to get my ass to work. <laughs> I have so much to do this week. Kids go back to school, like... Monday or Tuesday, I think. So it's that like weird time of the summer where you were like having some extra time and now that extra time is just gone. And you don't even know where the time went, right? <laughs> All right, last match though. This is it for me. I'll definitely do a feud video because it's a straight up, it's not like the uh, flash feuds where it's broken or there's guys and then girls and all this stuff. It's just a, it's just a feud, finally. And I'm definitely going to do a Boogeyman video because he's freaking amazing. He's probably going to do about two mil turn one um, this coming feud. So I'm definitely going to show you guys what that looks like in, in action. But uh, that's it for me. As always, guys, I really enjoyed making this video. This one um, especially because I got to throw, show you three different characters. I love all of them. And uh, like, leave me a like, comment. That's my favorite part. And subscribe, that helps me out too. And I'll see you on the next one. Beast Mode out.